He killed, murdered, and tortured Jim Short. Guilty of murder. Almost two years since the death of Austin defense attorney James Short, the man now convicted of the crime will soon learn his punishment. Sentencing for 26-year-old Justin Twine is already underway this afternoon and is expected to go into tomorrow. KXAN's Brittany Glass is live at the courthouse now after a full week of trial and only a few hours of deliberations this afternoon, Brittany. Well, Robert, Sydney, after two hours of deliberations this afternoon and no questions for the attorneys, the jury reached that guilty verdict. But not before attorneys on both sides made their final pitches to the jury. Both the defense and prosecution acknowledged defendant Justin Twine scammed people out of money over the internet. He's a con man. We, the jury, find defendant Justin Twine guilty of the offense of murder as alleged in the indictment. Both also agree James Short was looking for sex online. And the last I checked, searching for sex is not against the law. That man, he was searching for people to rob, come, and manipulate. It's a big difference. Prosecutors say Short's murder was premeditated. Twine set out to kill and steal from the 74-year-old victim. Short was tortured. But this was slow and methodical. Stabbed, cut, sliced, burned. And but the defense argues their client acted in self-defense, traumatized. There has to be a triggering event. He's either a serial killer or there's some horrible triggering event. Twine testified Short sexually assaulted him before the attack. It is convenient that the state of Texas gets to pick and choose who they decide to believe is a rape victim. Ultimately, the jury didn't buy the story that the defense attorney violently killed was the predator in this case. I'm told that sentencing began uh, shortly before 3.30 this afternoon. Now, the prosecution tells me they are going to call a number of witnesses in the sentencing phase as well. They expect those witnesses will take about an hour tomorrow morning. Now, as for Twine, he's facing anywhere from 5 to 99 years in prison. Reporting live in downtown Austin, Brittany Glass, KXAN News.